Right, this is my um, DIY synth. Please excuse the children in the background. Um, what we have here is two oscillators, one providing sawtooth on and off switch, square stroke pulse wave on and off switch, triangle sign, also uh, same on the other side except we don't have the sign on there. Uh, we have the pulse width negative and positive adjustment and you can have it pulse width manual or pulse width uh, just pulse width adjusting it can be pulse width modulated by the LFO which is um, over there right okay and we just have volume controls for each um, different waveform so you can have multiple waveforms as opposed to just either or so we have obviously it runs in concurrent sort of order saw square triangle sign same on the other side so we have two oscillators there uh, LFO dual wave LFO wave speed and we have the LFO shape because you can either have it a triangle or a square and um, we've also got a switch where I can switch it so it turns to a sawtooth so we can have a sawtooth I'm not sure if I mentioned that and that was the speed the tuning of the LFO speed control that can go right up into the free, um, audio range and uh, can probably go as low as about well plus 45 cycles or should I say one cycle every 45 seconds and yeah and that's pretty much it um, over here we have the filter which is a state variable um, low pass, band pass, high pass, Steiner Parker clone and this is just an 8 diode version as I'm not running a higher voltage to uh, get that to work properly and I just found it sort of had a better response with the um, the diode ladder I was using